just wanted to give everyone a view on how I have my uh, weather station mounted. As you can see over here on the left, I have the rain gauge, which is on the WS5000, can be mounted separately. And I have the 2902 ambient weather, WS2902 on the top. And right down about midway there, I have the WS5000 ambient weather. And it's got a uh, uh, ultrasonic sensor. And that rain bucket up there goes with it on the left. Now I've used a RON25 top section, tower section on the bottom, sunk into the ground. And of course I have an in-fed ham radio long wire antenna that goes out to a tree over in this direction. But uh, got a little, just put it up so I got a little bit of cleanup on the wiring cable management on the bottom. But uh, so I've got the two units there. One is a little closer to the ground. A little bit of temperature difference, but otherwise most of the measurements are spot on to each other uh, via the console or internet. So that, uh, again, that's the ambient weather WS2902 on the top. And I've got mounted the uh, WS5000 on a RON25 top section. Now you can go out to DX Engineering uh, is a place, uh, source for tower sections. If you've got a little bit of property that you can mount something like this. Uh, that's, that's the way I've mounted my weather station and uh, just used a strong uh, mast uh, to extend that up but uh, but yeah I'll give you a little bit of mounting ideals for your weather station or one of the many ways <laughs>